here, come inside with me. Because at this very moment in time here, Danny here is getting a raw deal. But seeing as I'm a nice kind of guy and you're a market trader, I'm going to throw you a bit of a deal. Uh, well, the deal is this. If you can answer five correct questions in under 45 seconds, you don't have to go in this stuff, right? But Tony does. <laughs> all right then, uh, Tony. No. Now, oh, all right then. Well, listen, there are obvious answers to my questions that begins with the letter S, but your answers must not begin with that letter. Your 45 seconds starts now. What sort of food do you get in hot dogs? Uh. <laughs> Long things. <laughs> oh, I'll accept that. That's my gargoyle. What must drivers do when they see a red light? Pull up. Pull up. All right, I'll accept that. I know what you meant. Mm. Right. What comes out of a kettle when it's boiling? Water. Well, water. No, I was expecting. Well, all right, then. Yes, go on then. The word Mississippi has four of which letter? M. <laughs> no, I won't accept that at all. Okay. Right, now what do you normally find at the beach? Pebbles. Pebbles, I'll accept that. Mm. Right, what do you normally wash your hair with? Let them all you in! Yes! We've got your own back! You get, you get your own back trophy. Yay! You also get to take with you, right? You also get to take away and get your own backpack and video game. <laughs> anyway, that's enough from us this week. And remember, be nice to your children. It could be you in here. Bye bye! <laughs>
Things aren't looking too good for Richard at the moment as he's all set for a slip into the dip. But uh, being a nice kind of guy that I am, I've decided I'm going to throw you a life right. If you can answer five questions correctly and like these five guy or goyles, right, it means you don't have to go in this at all, but James does. I've got some questions here which have obvious answers that begin with the letter D, but I'm afraid your answers cannot start with any words that begin with D. Your 45 seconds starts now. How do people usually get into a room? Window. Yeah. <laughs> yes, I'll allow that. One gargoyle. If you were making a picture with a pencil, what would you be doing? Painting. No, I won't accept that. It's actually something like sketching, I don't know. Right, here we go. What animal is said to be man's best friend? Cat. <laughs> no! Right, what is the profession of Hercule Poirot? Private eye. Yes, I'll allow mm. that. That's two gargoyles. If you were thirsty, what should you do? Come on, think. Have think a glass before. of water. Oh, have a glass of water. That's fine. Mm. I'll allow that one. There you go. Right, what is the opposite of light? No, 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 no! It's a get your own back trophy. You also get to take away with you and get your own backpack, but you do get a video game as well. And remember, be nice to your children. You could be in here. Bye-bye! <laughs>
Not even a guess? Okay, June. fine. <laughs> June, that won't do. Right, if a cult is male, what is a filly? Not male. Not male, I'll accept that as three gargoyles. Marigold, Rose, Daisy and Lily are all names of what? Things that are in the, grow in the garden. Fine, I'll take mm. that, that's four gargoyles. Who was that lady who turned Cinderella's pumpkin into a cult? <laughs> and you haven't got it! You haven't got it! You have got your own back, how do you feel? Uh, right. All right, well there you are, there's your get your own back trophy. You also get the chance of taking away with you a get your own backpack with video game, no less. And all you get to take away is a very nasty smell. That's all from us this week at Get Your Own Back. And remember, be nice to your children. It could be you in this stuff. Goodbye! <laughs>is not looking too brilliant for pizza here as he is all set for a drop in the plop but seeing as I'm a nice kind of guy what I've decided to do is to throw you a lifeline if you can answer five questions correctly in under 45 seconds you don't get to go in the slimy stuff but Natasha does oh yeah <laughs> okay now now there are obvious answers to my questions that begin with the letter n but I'm afraid your answers cannot begin with that letter you have 45 seconds in which to do so your 45 seconds peter starts now where might you see the characters of Joe Mangle, Madge Robinson and Paul Robinson. On BBC One. Oh, uh, yeah, close. That'll do. One gargoyle. What is 20 minus 11? Uh, the, the one... the one after eight. <laughs> yeah, a bit after. I'll give you two for that one. What is the name of John Major's wife? Mrs Major. Mrs Major. I'll give you three gargoyles for that. <laughs> what might fishermen catch fish in? Uh, it's... Um, in a, in a net. No, it's in the sea. Ah, it's in that no, 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 no. In which month do we celebrate Bonfire Night? Uh, the month 
the month after October. Fine, I'll take that as a gargoyle. Here we go. If you start with three buns and eat them all, how many are left? trophy and also you get to take home with you and get your own backpack and video game! <laughs> and all that, all that Peter has to take home is a very nasty and slimy sm smell. Anyway, that's enough from us. May we please wish you a very messy Christmas and a happy new year. Goodbye! looking too great at the moment as Roger is now set for a uh, a flop into our personal font here but <laughs> I'm a nice kind of guy and what I'm going to do is I'm going to throw you a lifeline now if I, if you can answer five correct questions in under 45 seconds you lock out the drop mechanism which slaps you into here and you activate the vat of slime above Marnix's head and he gets a right head full. It makes him look a very funny colour indeed. Right. Okay? okay now there are very, very obvious answers that begin with the letter S. But unfortunately, the answers that you give me cannot begin with that letter. Right. Okay? Your 45 seconds starts now. In which month do schools go back after the summer holidays? The big beginning of the autumn. Oh, I'll have that one. Go on, one. What do pop stars sing? Um, uh, music that sounds good. <laughs> Bit dubious. Awful. Oh, no, no, I won't have that one now. Right, what substance falls from the sky in winter? Rain. No. What noise do some people make when they are asleep? Um, no noise. Um, no. no, what does SOS mean? Help! That's the one! That's yes. right. Yeah. What do you do as a red traffic light? Uh, go very slowly. No, no, yeah. you've only lit up two pumpkins. No. You know what happens now, don't you? I have an awful suspicion I do, <laughs> yes. Yeah. Marnix, in that case, please, get no. your own back by pulling that lever. No. Go! Take away the trophy and to get your own backpack with loads of goodies, but also you get to take away with you this special prize: two season tickets for any Odeon cinema of your choice. Yeah! Anyway, that concludes it for this week's episode of Get Your Own Back. But do join us again soon. And remember, grown-ups, be nice to your children. It could be you in the gun tank. Bye bye. <laughs> <laughs> But as for you two, come with me, because you know what time it is now, didn't you, Helen? I'm afraid so. Yes, it is. <laughs> it's that time now for the Gump Dump. <laughs> well, things aren't looking too great for Helen at the moment. <laughs> She's all set for a drop in that slimy stuff below her feet. But, seeing as I am a nice kind of guy, I will give you an alternative. If you can answer five correct questions in under 45 seconds, lighting those pumpkins behind you, you lock out the drop mechanism, which drops you in here, 
and you activate the one above Vicky's head. Now, there are very, very obvious answers to my questions that begin with the letter I. But unfortunately, the answers that you give me cannot begin with that letter. Right. OK? <laughs> Your 45 seconds, Helen, starts now. You need to attend one of these in order to get a job. Um, um, <laughs> interview. <laughs> it's an I word! Oops. What is the fluid put in a fountain pen? Blue. It's coloured blue. <laughs> oh, I'll have that. That's one. Where does Terry Wogan come from? Air. E I R E. Lovely. Thank you. <laughs> oh, she's being flashed now. What do you put in the drink to cool it down? Cold water that's frozen. I'll have that. Venice and Rome are cities in which country? The one that looks like a boat. <laughs> yes, I'll have that. <laughs> Ants, bees, and mosquitoes are all types of what? Um, can I? <laughs> so, so, no, no, I won't have that. No, no, no. no. And you never guess what that sound is. It's the sound that means that you haven't got it at all. Vicky, oh. you know what to do. Pull that lever and get your own back. Yeah. Oh. Well done, you've got your own back, so there you go, Vicky, this is for you, you'll get your own back trophy. And you also get to take away with you, you get your own backpack, which has got loads of goodies in it, plus this week's special prize, which is a wild and outrageous trip for you and your family for the whole weekend at Alton Towers. <laughs> anyway, that concludes it for this week's edition of Get Your Own Back. Now, please remember, do join us again soon, and grown-ups, remember, be nice to your children, it could be you in the gunk tank. Bye-bye! Great for Annie at the moment as she's set for a chomp on the chewy stuff. But seeing as I'm a nice kind of guy, I'm going to throw you a lifeline. If you can answer five correct questions in under 45 seconds, lighting the pumpkins as you go, you will lock out the drop mechanism which throws you into here and you'll open up that vat of slime above Lisa Jane's head. Okay, now there are very obvious answers to my questions that begin with the letter G, but your answers cannot begin with that letter. Your 45 seconds starts now. What is the opposite of a boy? Female, young person. Yes. What do you call the hot brown liquid served with meat? Um, it's like a sauce, meat flavoured sauce. Yes. What position does England soccer star Chris Woods play? Um, he plays sort of in between the posts and the nets. Yes, I shall accept that. What do you call your mother's mother? Um, um nanny. <laughs> yes. What do you call the spirit of a dead person? <laughs> yes, I'll accept that. <laughs> That's it, you've done it. You've lit all five pumpkins, so you've saved yourself. I'm sorry, <laughs> Lisa. <laughs> Join us again soon when we'll have another grown up in the gunge. Bye bye. <laughs> Welcome to my gunky lair. And as you can see right here, Bob is now poised for a drop in my personal slop. But being the kind of guy that I am, I'm going to uh, throw you a lifeline, Bob. If you can answer five questions correctly in under 45 seconds, you will lock out the drop mechanism that will drop you into here and you will activate that load of slime above Lindsay's head, thus turning the tables and making a very messy into the bargain. OK, Bob, I'm going to ask you a set of questions which has got some obvious answers that begin with the letter F. But unfortunately, your answers that you give me cannot begin with that letter. 
Your 45 seconds start now. What kind of animal is Kermit? Toad. I'll have that. Where do farmers work? In the country. <laughs> OK, I'll have that. What is the opposite to slim? Fat. Ah, F word, you can't have that. What do fishermen catch? Um, cod. <laughs> OK, that's fine. Who climbs up... I'm oh, sorry, who climbs down chimneys at Christmas? Santa Claus. I'll have that. What do you call a young horse? Foal. Oh. That, no, no, that, that's an F word. What part of your body touches the ground as you walk? Oh, and that sound means that you haven't got it. You've only lit up four. You know what to do, Lindsay. Pull the lever and get your own back! <laughs> that is brilliant work, well, Lindsay. There you have it. You've got your own back. Therefore, you get a get your own back trophy. You also get to take away with you a get your own backpack with loads of goodies. Plus, a family trip to Boulogne on hover speed to visit the underwater aquarium Nausicaa. <laughs> oh, what a great place it is. How do you feel about getting your own back? Brilliant. Oh, I bet you do feel brilliant. Well done, you deserve it. And as for you, mate, you get to take home that very orange tint that you have all over your body at the moment. But thank you very much for taking part. Anyway, that's enough from us this week at Get Your Own Back. But do join us again next week when we might have another grown-up in the guns. Goodbye! <laughs>
Now, which animal represents the star sign Leo? Pass. All right. Which, do, which <laughs> meal do you eat in the middle of the day? Binge. Pardon? Binge. Binge? Oh, I'll have that. Right. <laughs> what is a pencil made of? Ink. No. <laughs> what is Windermere in Cumbria? A beak. Leak. Okay. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> It's an L word anyway. Right, which team won the FA Cup in 1992? Leeds. No, besides it's an L word anyway, it was Liverpool. In which city would you find Buckingham Palace? <laughs> no, you haven't done it. That sound means you haven't done it. You only got one pumpkin. So you know what to do, Derek? Pull that lever. Go on. Wow. Wow, look at that. You also get to take away with you and get your own backpack with loads of goodies. Plus, this week's special prize, be the envy of your friends and take your whole family for the whole weekend at Alton Towers. Anyway, that's it for this week at Get Your Own Back. But please remember, we're on again real soon at Be Nice to Your Children. They could have you in here. Goodbye! Goodbye! No time for begging for mercy now, mate, because it's now time for the gunk dunk. <laughs> well, things aren't looking too great for our Martin as he's now sitting there poised amongst the slimy stuff. His toes are even touching it too. He's a big lad. But seeing as I'm a nice kind of guy, I'm going to throw you a lifeline. OK? Now, if you can answer five correct questions in under 45 seconds, lighting the pumpkins behind you, you will lock out the drop mechanism that will throw you into here, and you will open up the vat of slime above young Samantha's head. There are very, very obvious answers to my questions that begin with the letter B. But unfortunately, your answers that you give me cannot begin with that letter. Your 45 seconds starts now. What surface do you sleep on? Mattress. Yes. Where did the 1992 Summer Olympics take place? Um, in Spain. <laughs> yes. What character did Roger Moore and Sean Connery both play? 007. Yes. What is the opposite of forwards? <laughs> Reverse. Yes. Australians throw them and they come back. What are they? Eight sticks. Yes! Which means? Really sorry, Samantha. You're going to get a head full of gum. I see. Oh. So oh. what are we going to do with That's right. Yes, we are. So three, two, one, go. <laughs> I know you didn't quite get the chance to get your own back, but well done. Thank you very much for getting this far. We're going to give you a get your own backpack with loads of goodies. Plus, this week's special prize, which is a trip with you and your family to Boulogne on Hover Speed, where you can visit the Underworld Aquarium Nautica. Yeah! And as for you, as for you, you get this trophy here as consolation and also that grungy outfit. How do you feel? Oh, great. Thank you. <laughs> and you look great, too. Anyway, that's it for us this week at Get Your Own Back. But remember, grown-ups, be nice to your children. It could be you in here. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> It's that time to take that ghost train ride towards the gunk dunk. Step through those doors. Go on. Well, here we are once again in that region where the gunge hangs out. And as you can see, our friend Angela doesn't look too pleasant as she's all set for a plop in me slop. <laughs> but seeing as I'm a nice kind of guy, I'm going to throw you a lifeline. If you can answer five correct questions in under 45 seconds, you lock out the drop mechanism that slams you into here and you open the vat of gunge above Louise's head 
and thus making our head very, very messy indeed. <laughs> All right? Now, there are very, very obvious answers to my questions that begin with the letter C. But unfortunately, your answers that you give me cannot begin with that letter. Okay? Your 45 seconds starts now. Which pantomime character marries Prince Charming? It's the ugly sister's stepsister. Good one. What are Persians, tabbies and Siamese animals? Small lions. <laughs> yeah, go on. What food do Bugs Bunny eat? Vegetables. I'll have that. What is a baby bed known as? A small bed. Yes, I'll have that. <laughs> From where do Cornish pasties originate? Um, New Key Way? Blue Way? Yes, I'll have that. You've done it. Look at that. Look at that. Five and under 45 seconds. You know what this means. I'm really sorry, Louise. I'm really sorry. <laughs> because you get this get your own back to me, but we can't send this lady home nice and dry, can we? No! So what do we have to do? No! That's right, in the gun, I'm going to press the right control. Goodbye! No! No! Yes! Yes! Listen, I know you didn't quite get your own back, right? But you do actually get to take away with you and get your own back plaque with loads of goodies, plus this week's special prize. Yes, you can leave your homework far behind when you take you and your family for a whole weekend to the sunny and wonderful world of Alton Towers. Yeah! And as for you, well, you get you get your own back trophy, but I'll give it to you just as soon as you've got demucked and dried off, all right? Anyway, that concludes it this week for Get Your Own Back, but do join us again soon, where we'll have another grown-up in the guns. Bye-bye! <laughs> too great for our Sue at the moment as she is set for a drop in a plop but I'm a nice kind of guy and I'm gonna try and throw you the lifeline as best as I can okay. now if you can answer five correct questions in under 45 seconds lighting the pumpkins behind you you lock out the drop mechanism that throws you into here and you open up the vat of gunge above Gareth's head okay all right now there are very very obvious answers to my questions that begin with the letter T but unfortunately your answers cannot begin <coughs> with that letter your 45 seconds starts now. You might go into one of these if you were hypnotised. A woman that puts you to sleep. Nah, too vague. <laughs> what is the loud noise that goes with lightning? The Big Bang. Yes. Where would you go to see a play? A cinema. <laughs> yes. What in England is considered to be the best drink of the day? Brown stuff. Yes, I'll have that. What is the day after today? Next day. Yes. Which night of the week is Top of the Pops on? The day after Wednesday. That's the one. That's it. You've done it. You have managed to light all five of these. Gareth, Gareth, oh, I'm so sorry, but you've oh. begun. Turn the tables at the last second. You get, you'll get your own back trophy. Look at that. But, but, we can't send this woman home nice and dry, can we? We, we can't send her home guns free. So what are we going to do? We're going to chuck her in. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> <laughs> well, Gareth, Gareth, I know you didn't quite get your own back, but thank you very much for taking part. 
not only do you get to take it away with you and get your own backpack, plus loads of goodies, but also this week's special prize. You and your friend can spend a whole season watching as many films as you like at any Odeon cinemas. Yeah! Anyway, ladies and gents, boys and girls, that concludes it for this week's show. Get your own back, but do join us again soon. And remember, growing up, be nice to your children. It could be you in the gunk tank. Bye bye. <laughs>
Glass. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'll let you have that one. What is Noah and the animals' famous means of transport? No. Yes, I'll have that. What is the opposite to disappear? Uh, turn up. Fine. What do you chop wood with? Okay. Fine, I'll have that. Which Greek god held up the... Oh, no! You only got four! You only got four pumpkins! You know what this means! Ben! Ben! Pull that lever and get your own back! You also get to have a get your own backpack plus this special prize, a trip of a lifetime, a weekend to Alton Towers for your whole family. Yeah. Anyway, that's enough from us at Get Your Own Back this week, but please remember, grown-ups, be nice to your children. It could be you in this gun tank very soon. Bye-bye! Bye-bye! <laughs> Don't wave too much. I'll tell you why, Philippa. Because it's that time where we take that ghostly train ride towards I the like gunk it. dunk. <laughs> and what a way to end this series. As you can see here, Philippa <laughs> Forrester is all set for a flop <laughs> in me plop. I'm going to ask you a series of questions, and if you get five of the questions right in under 45 seconds, lighting the pumpkins. You will lock out the drop mechanism that will save you from falling into this, and yes. you will operate the vat of slime above young Gavin's head, giving him a real ah, face ah, ball. Ah, <laughs> so I'm going to ask you some really, really obvious questions that have obvious answers that begin with the letter M. But unfortunately, the answers that you give me cannot begin with that letter. Right. Okay? <clears throat> Your 45 seconds, Philippa, starts now. Which month follows April? The one before June. Good. In the cartoon series Tom and Jerry, Tom is a cat and Jerry is what? A rodent. Good, I'll have that. Lipstick, eyeliner, mascara are all types of? Cosmetics. Cosmetics is right. What number is written as one and six noughts? A thousand thousand? <laughs> OK, yes, I'll have that. What do you call the growth which grows on a man's upper lip? Um. Yeah, all right then. Hair, hair, I'll take that. That's it! I'm a lady! Oh, Gabby, man, what can I say? Family and stuff. This being Philippa Forrester, you get your, get your own back trophy. But the thing is, though, we can't let you accept it looking as dry as that, can we? Yes. Three, two, one, go! <laughs> I know that you didn't quite get your own back, but we are going to give you a get your own backpack, which contains loads of goodies, plus this very special prize. Be the envy of all your skating friends everywhere with a really fast-moving, hip-looking set of inliners. Yeah! So there you go. That concludes it for this year's session of Get Your Own Back. And remember, if you've got a grown-up that gets on your nerves, write into the BBC and get us on Get Your Own Back. It's going to be great. Thanks a lot. What? No! Get